Hello and welcome to this video tutorial number six brought to you by Renesas Electronics Europe. This is actually the last tutorial and in this video I'm going to show you how to configure your lighting system for DMAX 512 communications. So for demonstrating the, the DMAX communications we need to program the DMAX slave board first. So we are going to start a new project in the AppliLED EZ using the same demo board, just click OK. So we've created a new project. Now we go and select DMAX 512. There are more settings here. You can set the address for each of your three LED channels, but one, two, three uh, is fine with me. I just click OK, save, um, just call it DMAX, click save. So the new project is created. Click on Gen to generate the C code, uh, which would generate um, all the uh, functions for DMX uh, 512 protocol. Click on Close. Click on Program uh, to program the microcontroller uh, with the generated code. Close. So once the RL78I1A board is programmed with the DMX code, we connect the system as follows. We are using the same master communications board, which supports both DALI and DMX communications, connected with the USB cable to the PC, where we will be using the DMX controller software tool, and connect the DMX um, wires. There are just uh, three wires to connect to the um, available DMX connector on the DMX slave board, which is based on the RL78I1A microcontroller. So this is how the boards are actually connected. Uh, so we've got the same master communications board that we used before for the dialer communications, connected with the USB cable to the PC, where we will be using uh, the DMX software GUI tool in a minute for sending commands uh, to the DMX slave board, which is this. Uh, and this is the RL78I1A demo board, connected uh, with three wires, which is the DMX bus uh, to the DMX master board. You can connect um, your custom DMX slave boards to the same bus and using the same software for controlling the entire network. So this is the DMX GUI software tool, uh, specifically designed for controlling the DMX network. Uh, so you can send um, DMX scene commands in real time. <clears throat> so the menu in the top uh, includes file with basic stuff such as uh, uh, open, create new project, open existing project and save uh, project. Uh, the scene menu uh, includes uh, commands for uh, the actual scenes where you can uh, copy scenes, paste, uh, insert in between or delete scenes. The slave option includes um, commands for assigning the addresses. So at the moment we've got three uh, LED channels, uh, hence three addresses already uh, assigned. Uh, we've got the run menu. Um, we've actually got it graphically here uh, where we have uh, uh, the go, uh, step through, uh, pause and stop. Uh, that is for the scenes. Uh, that's for um, going between the scenes. We've got the settings menu where we uh, set the rate actually uh, to go between the scenes currently is set to one second which is fine and um, we've got the serial uh, where we make sure that um, we are connected to the right port with the USB cable uh, for the uh, master communications board and the help with the version. Uh, version 1 is the latest so let's just uh, design our scenes uh, just to demonstrate uh, uh, the operation of this uh, software tool. So let's have uh, the first address um, set to maximum, and the second uh, to minimum, the third one is back to maximum. Um, then um, uh, in, this, in the next scene we'll have the first address to, to the minimum, the second defined to, set to the maximum and back to the minimum and uh, so on just to see the uh, uh, the, the switching uh, between the uh, uh, scenes. So the three, three scenes uh, are going to do for now. Uh, let's just click on Go. And as you can see, uh, the uh, scenes are switching. You can see on the LEDs the lights um, are, are switching on and off uh, depending on the scenes. You can pause, you can step 
uh, through the scenes and you can continue like this uh, with uh, designing more scenes. Uh, so this is pretty much it. This is a very um, simple tool but very useful for um, uh, playing with your DMX network. Um, and um, this is the end of the, um, this is the final tutorial. Uh, thank you very much for listening. Uh, we've gone through uh, three GUI tools uh, for lighting development, including the DMX Master GUI tool, the DALI Master GUI tool, and the AppliLED EZ GUI tool for uh, designing uh, LED driver system with uh, Renesis microcontrollers. All of the three tools are available free for download on Renesis website. Thank you.